At this hour, law enforcement in Washington County are searching for a suspect that KDKA has learned was reportedly involved in two separate shootings less than an hour apart. Lindsay Ward joins us live and has been monitoring the search overnight. So, Lindsay, what can you tell us? Heather, good morning to you. Right now, police in multiple counties are searching for Zachary Sadler. They say he's wanted in both shootings, and in the one, a man was shot and killed just outside of a store. Take a look at this News Chopper 2 video that our cameras captured. It shows you just how active of a scene it was Tuesday afternoon. And this is the parking lot of a family dollar store along Highland Avenue in Washington County. The victim here, according to the coroner, has been identified as Darnell Brown. Then, just less than an hour later, another shooting. Also also in Washington County. This one happened on Heslip Avenue in Donora. The victim was flown from the scene and we're look, working to learn their condition. Now, police are also trying to figure out what really led up to all of this violence in the first place. It appears as though it was a targeted shooting. Whether it was a drive by, I don't know right now. There was no altercation prior to. None of the witnesses observed any type of altercation. We don't know what the connection is between the victim and the shooter. In the meantime, here is some information we know about Sadler from authorities. They believe he may be driving a 2013 black BMW. Here's a look at his license plate for you. Take a good look at it. Police say Sadler also has facial tattoos, and he was last seen wearing a black hoodie and black sweatpants with gold lettering. We did reach out to authorities this morning. We're hoping to get more information as soon as we do. We'll pass it along to you. Reporting live, I'm Lindsay Ward, KDK News.